Right, so hey guys, what is going on? My name is Ben, and welcome. That was not the right intro. Good afternoon, guys. How are we all doing? My name is Ben, and welcome back to the Daily Vlog. Today is Tuesday, 30th of January. So, today, what I'm basically going to do is I'm going to check that I've got all my equipment and that it's all working because I need it all for tomorrow. Now, the question is, is do I take my school bag and risk the life, or do I take my camera bag and look like a pleb? I take my camera all the time. It's never been broken, so I don't know. I think tomorrow, though. I don't know, because I don't know what I'm going to take. I'm going to take all the other batteries. I'm going to take this lens. There is just going to be a lot of stuff that's expensive, so I think it'll probably be a good idea to take my camera bag uh, and then, like, a CEX-type bag or something for my... I'm going to take what I'm wearing now. So it's all black, and um, the reason why I do that is when I'm when I'm filming stuff is because it doesn't reflect, so like no light necessarily like like reflects or goes into the camera or anything. So a bit of scientific fact we are there. Most cameramen will always wear black. This is a tiny bit annoying. Yeah, I've lost the screw that I'm supposed to be able to like put on there. What you're supposed to be able to do is get a screw. Take this bit off the tripod, put th this bit solidly onto the tripod, and then put the um, head onto there, and then you can move the camera around while it's sliding. Because I've lost that screw, I just have to put my camera on it, and I can only slide sideways. And then if I untwist that, if I twist that one, if I twist that, then I can move it. So, so I can only start to get shots like that when I could have got like nice angled shots. But then again, I guess if I wanted to do shots like that, I could always do it handheld. I think it's a good job I actually have a TV. So I've been using my laptop behind my TV for, I don't know, since before Christmas, right? And I put my laptop behind there, HDMI in. As normal, but I close my laptop because I set a setting on my laptop for it not to close, to not like sl going to sleep mode when the lid is shut. So I put it flat as if I, I just closed the laptop and was about to take it somewhere. It fell down the back of my desk, hit the floor, screen went black. The way I know that is obviously because I pressed it and I was just like the the bezel around my the the display come off, and I just thought this ain't gonna work. So, my laptop doesn't actually work with the screen. I don't think, anyway, because I don't know, to be honest, because when I did it, it was, it come up black, and then it lit up, like, grey. Like, the black, it was black, but the screen was on. Nothing happened, so I just thought, mm, I, think. I just thought, right, well, plug it into HDMI. If the actual internals are broke, it won't do anything on there. Um... So I plugged it in through HDMI, mouse, keyboard, wireless mouse and keyboard, fine. Works. It come up in extended mode. Oh, not extended, it come up in duplicate mode, so the screen was like a weird 4x3 aspect ratio, so I was like, oh, what's going on there then? And then, no, it just turns out I wasn't in the second screen only mode, which is what I'm normally in. Um, so hopefully the screen isn't broke. Um, you know what, let's try it. Time for the moment of truth. Does the screen No is the answer. It's broken. That can't be good. Yep, yeah, the screen is definitely broke. Let's just do it one last time. Windows control P and instead of setting it to I'll set it to duplicate because then that should it should show up on both screens. As you can see that screen is still black. I don't know why. I've dropped it before and it's not done that. All that's ever happened really is it's crashed. Good job I actually had a screen, however it is a bad screen, so... See if you want to send me a monitor, you know, I'd be appreciated. So literally the only problem with having to do it like that is because of that thing I wanted to edit. I want to do colour correction in it. And I can't do it on there. Then again, there is a way around this. I want to make a colour correction. I can trust the screen on my phone to be accurate enough to a point because it's an OLED thing. So I can just literally 
zoom. Well, I have to do something to be able to see. Spot it, I. And then I press. Pl do you mean? Anyway, I think I'm going to end this video here because I'm a bit annoyed actually. It has, it has quite annoyed me. But in a, at the same respect, realistically, the only difference is that I can't use it the way I'd normally use it. So I'm getting that refund off um, the gimbal company. So I'm going to buy a new one of these arm stands. Because I think I need one. I'm quite honest with you. That one's brock. So I'm gonna get a new one of them with that refunded money. Uh, one's broke. What is it with everything from China being broken? Hashtag Toshiba. So I'm gonna end this video. If you haven't joined, sure to let me know below in the like on it if you wanna see more from me. Be sure to subscribe. So yes, bye bye. Peace. <laughs>